honestly, I'm just happy to be in front of the camera again because that means already I know what I like. I like this part and it just means I'm not behind the laptop editing because I don't like that part. Seriously, last video, every single segment that I edited, <laughs> ed did, 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 I Googled it. Thank God for Google because that's where I was at. So I'm going to film this video now and we'll see what's up in the kitchen. Do you like my makeup today? I, I'm totally an all natural girl, but I do like a little extra stuff on the eye. Um, blue is really bright and beautiful, but the other thing is there's a secret to why we're blue, but I'll tell you that in another video. Sylvie, Sylvie, people clicked on this because this is a food video. Not everyone likes other stuff. Sometimes they just want to see how rainbow lattes are made, okay? So you don't have to tell everyone. Every but eyes are the window to the soul, so I want you to look me in the eye when I'm talking to you. Yeah, okay. That's... Now I feel embarrassed. <laughs> or shy or something. I don't even know what that little rant was. I just had to get it off my chest because I feel like it's very obvious that my eye has a blue line under it. And I want you to know why I did that because it's my favorite color. Okay. <laughs> Short girl issues. Around Christmas time, I bought myself um, some gifts that I haven't used till now because I wanted to try them out for the first time on camera. Man, I wish I hadn't done that because it took ages. So anyways, I have been reading different health benefits, obviously, and I decided to get... Can you see me? <laughs> I'm not that short. I decided to get um, lavender milk to try out because I want to make a purple latte. I love the colors of the rainbow, so why not go all in? So, and then I got a blue milk latte, which I guess the main um, in here is pea protein and spirulina powder. So, I'm going to have a blue latte, a purple latte, of course the good old matcha latte green, and then I'm going to do show you uh, my version of how I drink a turmeric latte, and that's going to be my treat today since I had such a late breakfast and I'm going to wait a while to eat lunch, so I'm just going to show you my colorful kitchen. Recently I've been uh, food journaling, so I've been doing this every day and that's really cool because it's helping me stay on track and I also track like my moods, my energy levels, how I feel, that's really cool because then that way like if I have a bad day and I don't know what like triggered it. I can look back and see what's actually causing me um, issues and then I know to every single little detail, every little thing is recorded. Around Christmas I also bought me one of these handy dandy blenders and this has been one of the best purchases I've ever made. It costs like 22 bucks or something off Amazon and this saves so much time instead of putting up into the blender every time. and shooting stuff all over the ceiling and then having to wash it every time because sometimes I'm lazy. This just gets it done. Let's see if I can film and pour because I doubt it, but let's do this. But as you see, I have two milks here. I have almond milk and I always use unsweetened and I have oat milk because it is more calories but it's naturally sweeter. So I am trying to stay away from um, adding sugars, even like zero calorie sugars. So my trick is I'm gonna do a cup of almond milk and I'm gonna make two of these lattes at once. So a cup of almond milk and then a cup of oat milk. See how it's like thicker? It's definitely richer, creamier. The reason I like oat milk is because I'm not really a fan of a lot of sweet taste, but I do appreciate how there's actually less stuff added in there. Um, it's pretty much just oats and water, so that's cool. Almond milk has like extra thickeners, and so that's going to go for a while, and then we'll be back. Oh, I forgot to say I started boiling my water to make my matcha because I actually like it iced. Um, this recipe is from my friend. I never used to like matcha before this, so thanks, Annie. What? What? Are you being naughty? Yes! Yes? Yes! Why? 
I know. You don't know? What? Don't you want to be a good girl? Yes. Okay. You want to be naughty and good? Yeah. Oh. So we're going to start with the matcha and I have a glass. And my hot water's done. So I put like a tablespoon. And I just got this from Costco. It's a good deal. Good uh, clean brand. Got a tablespoon. I'm putting it in there. And then I just pour a little hot water in there so that it mixes up because who likes clumpy drinks? And then, oh, not any much chair. <laughs> okay, and then actually I like, you know, as much healthy products, products, um, ingredients going into my body as possible during a day. So I really double up when I can. So, but spirulina is so strong, like I don't like the taste so much. I'm thinking of the majority of people in the world probably don't eat enough greens in their diet so it is a good way to get all the nutritional value from something green that's quick and easy and lots of people don't think about it when they're eating diets that they actually are consuming a lot of bad um, calories from drinks because drink calories do stack up they're not empty calories so if you're drinking soda and beer and other stuff during the day even like your coffees and all that stuff it is calories but they aren't good calories so if you could switch to something like maybe a latte that will bring you pleasure and joy and is full of the color green maybe those calories will be worth something going into your body and you'll be feeding it instead of um, deleting from it, depleting from it, you know, like taking away all your hard work. This will help you with your hard work. If you're like working out like me and you're trying to get somewhere and you also want to feed your body and keep it full naturally. So anyways, this is how I make my matcha. Matcha is pretty bitter to me, and I don't like sweet stuff, so it might be pretty bitter to you. And then I put like a tablespoon of, of stevia mixed sugar in there, and then I put a nice drizzle of vanilla for more flavor. Gotta cover up the spirulina because I love eating like spinach and stuff, but spirulina to me tastes like dried fish, so who wants to drink dried fish? But guys, the health benefits outweigh the taste, and I'm telling you a way to make it taste delicious, so try it. A half full of oat milk, then I'm gonna shake some cinnamon. Cinnamon balances your blood sugar, so I add this to like all my smoothies and all my drinks. It's pretty good, so. Check that out because keeping your insulin levels balanced and not spiked is something that helps you lose weight. Uh, naturally and healthy way because I'm not like on a diet, starve yourself. I'm like feed your body, keep it happy, and put all the good stuff in there and grow from there. Now I'm going to fill the rest of this with water, shake it, shake it, shake it, and I'll be back. So ta-da, there you have it, your ice masha. Drink number one, and like I said, I like that one cold. Okay, let's see if I can do this. I am uh, right-handed, folks, so this is gonna be a challenge. This is supposed to be a level tea <laughs> teaspoon. <laughs> Put lavender in there. And there's supposed to be two of this one, so one, two. And the purpose for the blue milk latte is supposed to help you um, de-stress, de-stress is also supposed to help you focus. Why does my camera never focus? Obviously I have to play around with it. The purpose of the blue milk latte is to help you calm your nerves. Obviously I need to do that right now. And the purpose of the lavender one, the purple one, is to help you wind down for the evening. So I'm gonna taste that one, but I'm not gonna drink it because I don't wanna conk out in the middle of the afternoon. I got tons of stuff to do. I'm learning that all my handheld footage is probably gonna be crap and 
Which saddens me because I like the vlogger style. I'm not like a perfectionist unless I want to be. And I'm more like, let's do this, let's try it out, let's give it a go. Let's fail a couple times and get better every time. So, you'll see that in my videos. I, in the beginning, am going to be rough. But I'll get better, I promise. I can promise you that. I'll always get better. I'm always going to do better. Okay, so I'm gonna pour my warm milk in these two and then give them a spin. Ooh, it really is blue! Turmeric is the drink that I drink most often. So again, I'm gonna put, um, well I'm gonna put half a cup of oat and half a cup of almond milk. And this is my favorite recipe. Okay, turmeric is good for so many things, obviously. So I'm going to do half and half because I never really measure things anyways. Um, it's anti-inflammatory. Everyone pretty much um, knows that. Also, it is good for boosting your mood level. So antidepressant. It's good for skin issues. I want you guys to know that I like the taste of healthy things, but not everyone I know does. So, I'm going to tell you what I think tastes delicious and then you can try it out and go from there because I want you to get healthy the way that you like to, not necessarily the way I like to because we're different people, we have different schedules, so like I'm a stay at home mom, I have time to mess around in the kitchen. If you're a busier person that works full time, I understand if you can't like mess around, but what else do I have to do literally? But a lot of us are home right now, so instead of like ripping open the bag of Doritos, sorry, um, maybe we could, you know, take a little extra time to make ourselves something that's delicious and nutritious. Because my husband is not as much of a health freak as I am, and he loves this drink. At night, if I make it for myself, he's like, please make me some. So yeah, this actually helps you sleep better too, I've found. Where's my turmeric? So I'm gonna put that much in there for myself. You don't want it to be too overpowering. And then I put equal amount of ginger. And that is also really good for you. I'm gonna probably list the benefits and I'm also gonna do uh, cinnamon. Not only is it amazing flavor, it also, you know, like helps slow your blood sugar from spiking. So there's the cinnamon in there. And then I do about half a teaspoon of vanilla. I do for a cup of that, I'm gonna do a teaspoon of the stevia blend. Okay, because like I said, Oat milk is pretty naturally sweet. I'm not a huge sugar fan, and even though I am using zero calorie sugars, I'm still trying to minimize sweetness in my life. I'm a savory girl, I'm a savory girl. Very important to help bring out and actually um, absorb all the benefits of turmeric is black pepper. Don't worry. It's not going to be a lot. You're not going to taste it. Um, actually, I like sometimes adding salt or pepper to my drinks because I just said it. I'm a savory girl. But it actually brings out the flavors to the fullness. Even if you think, oh, it won't taste good in there, it you don't really taste the salt or the pepper. It just brings forth the richness of all the flavors. You know, like in a bowl of soup. If you didn't add salt to soup, it wouldn't taste so good. So anyways, because I put salt in my protein drink, guys, so I'm going to put like a shake or two of pepper. Okay, first, let's try lavender. Please don't pass out. Please don't pass out. I added no sweetener to these. Um, it was half almond milk, half oat milk. It's okay. Definitely tastes like a good bedtime sleep. It tastes like if melatonin was a drink, it would taste like that. My opinion. Also, the nutritional value is there and everything, but saying it was purple is kind of a little of an overstatement because it's pale gray. 
The blue, on the other hand, I'm happy with the color of that. Can you see it? Pea protein spirulina. That's that's pretty tasty. I drink that. It's more uh, creamy and buttery. So I like that. And high in protein. I'm all for that these days. My body craves protein. Okay. Matcha, I know I like it. Mmm. Yeah, this. Now, this. Made this way, I love matcha. Before I made it this way, I highly dislike matcha. You want to try it? Turmeric is going to be this, the baby the baby stealer of the day. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That one wins every time. So, if you guys are debating whether or not you should try healthy drinks and start replacing your other drinks and... It's in the evening and you're cozy and you're tired and you want to wind down. Consider putting your cell phone aside and making yourself a latte and curling up on the couch with your hubby and talking, maybe. There you go. That concludes the first in the series, The Health Three. Every time I talk, she cries. kitchen random as anything and also consider subscribing if you like going on adventures with us right yeah you want to say bye bye yeah bye okay bye. Callie ready you gotta end the video because we want to be cool bye Bill bye Bill okay now spread your hand yeah. <laughs>